Appalachian Wireless offers the easy way to pay with Forward Pay. And now it's even easier with unlimited talk text with three gigs for just $44.99. No credit check, no contract, no problem. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Friday afternoon, police cars and fire trucks drove through the community of River in Johnson County, complete with lights and sirens. Johnson County Sheriff's cruisers were packed full of toys. Santa and Mrs. Claus were on the back of a fire truck, and members of the community came to meet the little girl who sparked this entire effort, a six-year-old girl named Dora, who stopped smiling. When I went to the school as Miss Claus, Dora was put in my lap, and she didn't smile. She didn't climb up, she didn't hold me like the other kids. So when she got down, I asked her teachers, what's wrong? And she said, her mommy's sick. Four months ago, Dora's mother, Rebecca Colvin, was diagnosed with breast cancer. And that was followed a month later by more bad news. And found that it was uh, stage four breast cancer. It was in my breastbone and spine. And even though she doesn't really understand how serious that is, seeing the toll that the treatments are taking on her mother, has obviously affected Dora. I don't know that six months ago it didn't seem like she knew a stranger. She was like just as quick going to somebody as she was with me. But for a little while Friday afternoon Dora smiled. She even laughed as she opened presents with her family. Presents they would not have gotten had Dora not touched so many people. This would have been probably the worst Christmas that I'm aware of that they've ever been able to have. With the gas money and to get back and forth and, and everything, it, it pretty, pretty strapped. Rebecca says her doctors say her cancer is responding to the treatments, but that still doesn't stop her family from worrying. I thought that my nieces may not remember her, their mother, especially the youngest, um, Samantha. You know, she's too. But everyone will always remember this Christmas, when Santa and Mrs. Claus delivered presents and everyone was together. And even though Rebecca says times are tough and the treatments take a toll on her body, she's not giving up. I'm going to fight it. There's just no two ways about it. I, I'm not much for one just sitting down, rolling over and just letting it happen. I'm going to fight it. I've got a long life to live and I'm going to live it with my kids and my husband and my family. Reporting in River, Kentucky, for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.